All right, guys, I'm going to talk a little bit about a guy you're probably going to recognize um, from a lot of Arnold Schwarzenegger movies in particular. Uh, nothing lately. I think this guy kind of fell off the radar in the mid-2000s. Uh, as he got older, I think he's like 72 now. That's Sven Ol Thorsen. Now, this Sven was uh, a guy that appeared in a lot of Arnold Schwarzenegger movies, uh, from the time Arnold kind of broke into the industry, uh, he was in a bunch of them. Let's take a look here. Starting with Conan the Barbarian, Conan the Destroyer, Red Sonja, Raw Deal. Man, he just made a ton. Running Man, Predator, Red Heat, Twins, Total Recall, Terminator 2. He's been in about every damn Arnold Schwarzenegger movie uh, in the 80s and 90s. Um, so... He kind of followed or made his career off of Arnold. I think knowing Arnold Schwarzenegger maybe helped him, uh, you know, break into the business. Now Sven was a big, big man. Uh, man. Uh, you're talking about a guy that uh, was Denmark's strongest man in, in 1983, and I think Europe's strongest man in '82, or vice versa. One of those two. Six foot five. I think in the first Conan movie, he was weighing over 300 pounds, if I read that correctly uh, in Wikipedia. So he's a big dude. Obviously, uh, you know, he didn't follow the bodybuilding route uh, and stay in bodybuilding shape. But you see a picture of him here. You see how broad he is. He's on the left, of course. Big, thick guy. You know, he, Arnold looks a little lean in this pic. Uh, but Arnold wasn't as tall. This is actually from Gladiator. He played the uh, undefeated Gladiator that took on Russell Crowe's character. Uh, that they brought in to try and defeat Russell Crowe's character. That, of course, Russell Crowe ended up killing in the movie. Here's an old pick right here when Arnold was young. These guys are young now. Sven's like 72 now, something like that. So he's he's older than Arnold, considerably older than Arnold, actually. Well, five years, whatever it is. Uh, so, yeah, he's in the 70s. He kind of retired, um, it looks like, from acting, I think. Uh, according to Wikipedia, he lives in California. Uh, he's actually got some dogs that are show winners. He might be into dog training now. He actually was dating Grace Jones for a while, uh, and as of two, 2007, they have main, maintained an open relationship. Uh, of course, that's probably over now, but I guess in his autobiography, he says that he's basically a swinger. <laughs> cool, uh, whatever. Uh, anyway, yeah, so this guy was a big dude. Uh, you know, you probably remember his, his imposing uh, figure in the Conan movies. He was considerably larger than Arnold, uh, much taller, and appeared to be much thicker. Now, yeah, Arnold's more like this picture, for example, and this is raw deal. Arnold's definitely more developed muscular-wise. I mean, that's Arnold Schwarzenegger. Uh, but thickness and overall size, uh, height, etc., uh, this guy was a beast. Here he is a little bit older, of course, in the Gladiator movie. Uh, and here's an old-school pic again. You can see Arnold's overall development is better. Uh, but you can see the size on Sven. And here's a classic picture. Now this is a this has got to be you know in his 30s, 40s. It shows you how good he really looked. That that kind of body back then was a great body. Uh, you know, probably largely drug free. I mean, nowhere taken near the drugs that these guys are taking today to look like that. Probably. So this guy had killer genetics as well. Uh, here's another pic. Uh, they're wearing Arnold his new Maruno, the pumping iron shirts. Ah, uh, who knows how old this one is, I suppose that's the 70s, maybe, yeah, late, early 80s, uh, probably early 80s, I guess, but, uh, anyway, yeah, this guy, you know, he's still around, and he's still alive, so that's good, uh, probably won't see him in any movies or, or anything like that anytime, but, uh, nevertheless, a guy who made a ton, I mean, look at all these movies, I mean, that's crazy, man, you talk about three, four movies a year for, during the 80s and 90s, uh, a lot of years, so, uh, been in some big movies, Eraser, he was in Eraser, well, I mean, yeah, you know, and these are small parts, stunt, stunt only parts, so he did some stuntman work, obviously, but still, that's work, that's work in the industry, 13th Warrior, he was in that one, wow, that's interesting, End of Days, he was in that one, of course, Gladiator, uh, Collateral Damage, yeah, this guy's been in, like, every Schwarzenegger movie, up until the mid-2000s. Wow. Holy cow, dog. Slow down.